What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We've got another trailer reaction for you guys. Cyberpunk 2077 dropped an official gameplay trailer. Yep. Hopefully this game comes out when it says it's going to this time. I know it's been delayed. I know it's highly anticipated. A few times. Very excited to see what this looks like and you know, to get our hands on it finally and to play this damn game. You ready to check out this trailer? Yes. Let's go. They got a lock on us. Engine's been hit. Get us out of here. I'm losing control. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is going to look At incredible. CD Project Red, we dedicate ourselves to telling immersive stories. Yet with every new project, we set out to make our games bigger, more complex, deeply engaging. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Cyberpunk 2077 marries exploration of a vast open world with kinetic combat, story-changing player choices, and robust character development, all oh. to bring you into our vision of yeah, the grills. dark future. You ever feel like the city doesn't give you a choice? You either burn alive in it, or you never existed at all. The year is 2077. An economic crisis culminating in nuclear conflict has left America in pieces. Okay. With most of the continent degenerating into lawless war zones, people from all over have converged on the already overcrowded Night City, one of the world's last great megalopolises. A hub amassing the best in resources and know-how, and home to manufacturers of cutting-edge technologies. Night City continues to offer the promise of a civilized future. What? No, no, this isn't <laughs> happening. Oh, but it is. But it's some <laughs> sim stuff right there. A merciless struggle for power rages. Gangs, corporate agents, hustlers, religious cultists, politicians, and all manner of criminals strive to outplay one another. Ordinary people get caught in the crossfire. Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. In this world, consumed by never-ending conflict, sometimes only an outsider will get the job done. Elizabeth tells me you have answers for us. This is like some I'm GTA, and that some Sims. An urban mercenary, a cyber-enhanced gun for hire. You seem to understand each other. It's got a little bit of everything for sure. As a mercenary, you swear no allegiance. And some suicide You've squad. the outlaw <laughs> life. And trust that your abilities will carry you up Night City's ruthless underground social ladder. Heart of Night City. That's it right there. To thrive as a merc, you need the right combination of Ooh, gear, that's scary. skills, <laughs> and reputation. Dex had a load to say about you. I hope. Dude, the creativity you. of how everything the looks you earn, is you can turn yourself super into dope. Weapon, buying guns and enhancements in the hundreds. Ooh, throat punch. As you roam the Where's the character streets, that looks like you? You gain the experience you need to upgrade abilities and acquire perks. Yikes. Combine the right skills and gear to create a gunslinger with inhuman reflexes. A stealthy netrunner with command of all surrounding tech. Oh no, not stealth. I know. <laughs> We're great at that. Or practically anyone in between. Oh, shit. In Cyberpunk 2077, you steal a prototype biochip that can set you up for life. Being filthy rich. When its sealed this container is, like is some, ruptured, um... the only way to prevent the biochip from failing is to slot it into your head. Whoa. It turns out it contains the digitized soul of Johnny Well, Silverman, there he is. A dead rocker boy with violence on his mind. <laughs> I mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head right now. He's out for revenge. Aims that. to bring down the megacorp that made the chip. Do whatever Keanu. it takes to stop him. Defeat him. <laughs> Gut him. Love what is it. in your head can shift the balance of power in Night City. The high and mighty will do anything to lay their hands on it. Told you I'd end you someday. What was that other movie that Keanu was in? Not the Matrix. The choices you make will shape your story and determine how events unfold. V, you gotta take them down. That's why we're here. But not everything in Night City is a matter of life and death. Sometimes it's about style, choosing your look. You're right. Dude, this game you is going to be absolutely yourself. massive. Choosing how you spend your dirty money. 
Speaking of a roller coaster. <laughs> I think that dude was butt naked jumping in the water. Welcome to the next generation of open world adventure. Immerse yourself. He in literally Cyberpunk never finished. 2077. <laughs> wow. There's so much stuff. December 10th, we will see. I know, fingers crossed. Hopefully this game comes out December 10th. I know a lot of people have been waiting a very, very long time for it. This game looks incredible. It does, I the, agree. The options and the creativity and the freedom, it's just, all of it just looks like a gamer's absolute paradise. Because like you were even saying it throughout the game, it looks like it's got bits and pieces of a bunch of different games that you that can just like. like play and mess around with. And open world is usually a scary world over on Sticker Gaming. Um, but... <laughs> I mean, this game is going to be incredible, I, I think. I, I truly believe it once this game actually drops and gets released. There's just so much stuff. It looks massive. Yeah. It looks really, really, really big. It's something you could potentially never finish. I mean, if it's open world enough, yeah, it could be something that you just play forever and follow a main story and ride roller coasters. and. I think you should just, like... Skip the main story, just do all the side stuff. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We'll see when it comes out, see what kind of schedule we could put on this, and see if we could actually put a dent in it and play it. Because I want to. It looks exciting, it looks awesome, and it definitely looks like a lot of fun. So, yep. any other thoughts? Yep. All right, y'all. Share your thoughts down below. Leave some comments. What do you think? Are you excited for this? Are you hopeful that it's going to drop on the 10th? We will see. But leave your comments and we'll see y'all later. Bye. Yep, we're still in a bunch, bitches. Oh, man. <laughs> ah, shit. Ah! Oh, my God. What are you doing with your life if you don't put pineapple on pizza? What?